And detergent companies dealing with rising costs usually have two options. One is to raise prices. The other, cut sizes. But a controversial new report is questioning the latest change to Procter & Gamble's Tide detergent, wondering if it's doing both. To avoid price hikes, almost every major product in grocery stores is getting smaller these days. I recently checked out Kraft's Shake and Bake, down from 11 ounces to 9 ounces, and Nabisco's Triscuits, from 9.5 ounces down to 9 ounces. We've received the most complaints lately about Charmin, which recently made its rolls three-eighths of an inch skinnier. What I noticed was my toilet paper rolls are shrinking considerably. But the website mouseprint.org says P&G's liquid tide is both shrinking and raising prices at the same time. Mouseprint showed the old tide with Febreze, 100 ounces, versus the new tide with Febreze, now 92 ounces. That's not new. P&G announced the change to its premium liquid tide at the beginning of this year. But this is new. Mouseprint looked at the fine print and found while the old 100-ounce jug gave you 60 loads, the new 92-ounce jug gives just 48 loads. It says while the new jug is 8% smaller, you actually get 20% fewer washes. P&G responded by saying, we have upgraded the formulas, which has impacted dosing. And it says it's not changing the formula or size of regular Tide, just the premium version, such as Tide with Febreze. Now, I will post P&G's complete response to us that came in late today on WCPO.com.